She's back! Back from my hiatus. Where have you been, Victoria? You might ask. I was without power. But before we get into the story, if you like this content, or you like me even, like, comment, share, smash that like button. Do whatever you gotta do to make my content pop off. And let's get into today's story time. The other day I woke up prepared to shoot, edit, and record content for you all. A normal day, you know, a day in the life. Mm -mm. I go to make my protein smoothie as I always do. Recipe linked above. Mm -mm. And what happens? No power. Good morning, vloggy vlog. This is going to be a chaotic vlog because I woke up this morning to no power. I wasn't able to get I got a shower this morning and then realized that the power was off, so my hair air dried. I went to a Starbucks to charge my phone. I got followed. <laughs> I wasn't wearing this. I changed because um, you got to get the views. I charged my phone there to try to contact Comet, and this man followed me throughout the Starbucks and upstairs because it was connected to a hotel. Tried to ask me out. I was like, mm -mm, I'm not looking. No, thank you. Everything in my life right now is dead. So I thought it would be interesting to do a 48 hours without power or however long it takes for them to set up my services. So I don't know who the heck was paying because I've been living here for since December. Now, 24 hours is a long time. In fact, everything in my fridge ended up going bad. But originally, I picked up the phone after trying to flip my breaker. Hi Alex, my name is Victoria Myers. Um, I was calling because my electric was shut off today. I emailed you all because apparently I didn't even have an account with you guys. I was just checking to see if you got that and if I could get an estimated, I guess, time of service. Like an independent woman who doesn't want to be independent. Please save me. Now, this has happened before and things eventually worked out. So, you know, in times past when my power didn't work, I would just move my blender around to different outlets until it worked. I would go as far as trying to blend my smoothie in my bathroom before, so this is not something that is abnormal for this place. I don't know if, if the outlets get overloaded or what, but anyway, I moved my blender around to no avail, so I check my power box, I flip the breakers, nothing. I go downstairs to go leave because I'm like, let me just give it some time. I go to a coffee shop. I get back and I ask my door woman, like, hey, have you noticed anything? She's like, I haven't, but let me reach out to a few people and I'll get back to you. Come to find out, I forgot to, hey, for the last, how long have I been here? Five months? Five months for electric. Now, before, before you go, oh my goodness, how did, like, how did this even happen? Here's my, here's my plea. I am a very frugal gal. I pinch pennies. I'm a penny pincher, some might say. I love pinching pennies. So when I went to visit my parents back in, I think it was Thanksgiving time, right before I relocated here. And hours of operation. Please visit myshikago.com. going to my terminal and there was like a little you call those things where people like try to sell you stuff I don't know a little kiosk thing where somebody was like hey do you want to save money on your utilities who doesn't come on man sign me up so go so, and they give me a spiel I have an American Airlines card it's great for flying this is not not sponsored but seriously if you travel or want to travel get one of those put all your bills on that and it'll rack up points I haven't paid for lights in I think a minute it's been a minute <laughs> I go there, I get marketed to, they tell me in order to save money and get also bonus miles, you can sync over your utilities to American Airlines card and they will pay you additional points for doing that. So I'm like, oh great, you know what, I'm about to move, perfect, prime, clutch. Mm -mm. I remember, and this is the thing, one of my best friends, I was like, Tori, I remember you transferring your ut utilities. Me too, I remember it. Apparently not though. Because I get on the phone, they tell me I have to create a whole new account. And you said the service should be on in your name? It should be, yes. Okay. 
was gonna take 24 to 48 hours to get my power back on, which is not ideal. I do everything here. I never leave my house. Like if you see me nowadays, especially, I mean, I'll go to a, ca a cafe or whatever, but nowadays I literally do everything from here. I don't wanna be bothered right now. I'm in a very healing era. I'm trying to get my punani running. If you don't know, I have HA, hypothalamic amenorrhea. Like I need food. I'm in between feeding times half the time of my life right now. I have to eat a lot more than I used to. Okay, so I go out, got some work done. Just finished shooting some content in the sun. Crazy day. They said it could take 48, three days. They upped it. I'm glad I called them because they told me that if I wouldn't have called, the other lady didn't get the correct information and it would have, it would have taken even longer. I think I went upstairs and carried all my chargers. I have like so many charges. Thank God I charged my ring light because it was so dark and creepy. And I was fully prepared to not have my power on for another 48 hours. I okay, just got back from a long walk. It's spooky in here. I was gonna go to Trader Joe's, but they were closed. So I had to run to Whole Foods to get toothpaste. It was creepy getting home because there was this man that waited outside of Whole Foods. I guess he saw me walking and I went to leave and he got out of his car. Apparently he put on the blinkers, got out of his car and was like, excuse me, can I just tell you how beautiful you are? And then proceeded to like stay in his car, leave on the blinkers. And I just like, I get so creeped out with those people because I've been followed so many times that it's like scary. I'm always ready to do. I have my phone light on. I have my ring light on. Thank God I had that charged. I high key feel like I'm on Survivor right now. I feel like I'm starting to get cramps, which is a good sign, but washing my face. Thank God I, cha I charged this ring light. I use Sunday Riley CEO Glow. Do not do it. Do not. Apparently the vitamin C interacted with my skin and it's been months and my skin is textured and it won't go away. So don't do it. I literally, I was so hungry. For some reason my stove didn't work either and I'm confused. I'm still confused on that because it was technically just electric. Unless electric and gas are the same, I need to Google that and figure that out because I thought, oh, I could at least, you know, use a little candle and like do a little cooking on my on my stove, but no, I couldn't. My upstairs of this building does not have a microwave or a stove. I have grills outside that they just pulled out for like the spring and summer. I was about to bring my pot pan and cook some protein pasta on a grill, but I couldn't even figure out how to turn on the grill. When not in use. Okay. How the hell? That looks like something that would do something. up ordering burgers I got in sweet green earlier in the day um, and then I ended up ordering there's this place that has mini burgers because I was in the mood for a hamburger so I literally had on my ring light sat in my bed and ate my burgers hey where's my Rihanna Christmas tree topper the Christmas tree is no place for exposed breasts You're lucky I let you put up that wreath wreath witherspoon this is the nicest thing in your apartment mm -hmm. and fell asleep the next morning I woke up Lights were on, power was back on, and it really taught me to appreciate electricity. I felt like I was on Survivor, the Kardashians version. It was awful. But anyway, your girl is back, power is back on, just thought I'd give you this little update slash story time. Don't take your electric for granted, because goodness, I needed it. Make sure you sign up for your electric bill. I guess the pro is, is that I got five free months of electric. Like, I don't, I mean, I'll double check. Knock on wood, please God. But I think I didn't end up having to pay for the last five months of that. So a win is a win. I can deal with 24 hours if that saves me money. Cause I am, say it with me, a penny pincher. But anyway, if you like this type of content, give me a like, leave me a comment down below, letting me know what you'd like to see in my next video and I will see you so soon. Bye.